Buying is hard right now, so maybe you should build. Should you build or buy? Sometimes it's very hard to find exactly what you're looking for when you're buying a home. So maybe you should build. Here are some quick pros and cons. Pros. The biggest pro to building a home is you get exactly what you want in your price range, that is. From the paint color, flooring, tile, and layout, you get complete say. And if you find a reputable builder, you won't have to worry about repairs, replacements, or remodeling anytime soon. It's essentially move in ready when you're done. You'll also be able to make the home as smart and energy efficient as you want. Sounds pretty great, right? But now, the cons. It costs more, plain and simple. It will always cost you a bit more to build a new home than to move into a pre-existing one. That is if you're buying in a development. If you're buying land and building a home, it's much, much longer. Whereas if you find a home you love, you can sometimes move in within weeks. You also may have to deal with unexpected costs or delays as your home is being built. Most lenders build in at least a 10% gap for unexpected costs. This pandemic has caused the cost of construction materials to fluctuate wildly. And some materials are simply hard to come by due to ongoing supply chain issues. This can throw a lot of uncertainty into your moving plans. I have heard of some builders being six months to a year late. While you don't have to negotiate with the seller to build, you have to communicate a lot with the builder. That's why I always recommend you get a real estate agent to help you if you decide to build. The builder and their representative are looking to build their bottom line, not protect yours. A reputable agent that knows something about building can not only save you time and headaches, end up protecting your pocketbook as well. If you're thinking about going the building route, shoot me a message and let's talk about my favorite builders in the area.